Hey guys, welcome back to the, what is this, the fourth episode? <clears throat> yeah, the fourth episode of Timbered Stone. <laughs> uh, we've got a little ambient occlusion error that I've noticed, as you can see, but it only happens during a certain time of day, so I don't know. It could be my graphical drivers, something. I don't know. I know that if I go in and go into options and turn off... Uh, screen space ambient occlusion it stops so i like the shadows and we're not going to be sitting here staring at the campfire so i'm just going to leave it on hopefully you guys agree um let's see what we were doing we were building our walls just a basic wall around to try and you know just to give us somewhere to go uh, we've got our carrots going which are actually growing pretty well we got a good decent amount of carrots we got some wheat growing we got some potatoes going um what else we got going on we've got no storage issues now that we figured out that we need to build storage compartments in order to uh continue you know harvesting so let's unpause the game i've decided we're going to play on a little faster uh just mainly because the uh you know it was turning into three days where we're being a full you know three episodes rather for a full day uh, so we'll just get them going a little faster. Get all this stuff dug out. Get this stuff built. He's still building on these walls. Now we could have set it up to build two or three levels high. But I wanted to do it one level at a time. So that we could see the function and the tops of these and whatnot. and You know, just to keep it simple. Oh, oh. Did you see old boy come walking up and chilling, chilling? We've got our migrant fellers. Ha, ha, ha. Level three forager. Uh, he's a little sluggish. That's fine. I, I really don't care. I don't care. <laughs> We're going to take him. So let's pause the game. Let's take a peek at him. He's right there. Sel no, that's Selfina. That's my other guy. Um, is that the new guy we just got? Oster? Uh, let me turn this off. And let's see. What jobs this guy got? A miner? No? I think we may have had him. Where is it this guy? Mike Steven? Forager, level three. No, where's the where's the new? Here, why don't we just be smart? Uh, let's see, miner, a forager, a farmer, a stonemason, a carpenter, a wood chopper, a forager, a wood chopper, a builder. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh, right here. Mike, Steve, and Stefflin. Oh, I know you're all saying, Saint man, look at the damn text at the bottom. All right, so let's find him. Mike, Stefflin, is a forager. Well, we don't need another forager. So, what do we need? We An engineer is basically somebody you can, an adventurer, rather, somebody basically you can control. So, if I made him into an adventurer, I could then jump down into him, walk him around in first or third person view or whatnot, and I could actually fight with him or, or whatever else. We're, I'm not really interested in that yet. Um, Carpenter, I think, to be honest with you, for right now, it might be good to have another builder. Well, we'd have two people building, uh, or it would be good to have another miner. Um... Yeah, I think it would be more advantageous right now. We're going to make him another miner. Just for now, until we get all this stuff mined out to where we can build our wall. And then once we get our wall built, then we'll turn him in, or get that dug out, then we'll turn him into a, uh, into a builder. And then after that, we'll, we'll, this is going to be my jack of all trades, basically. Because this guy is not a builder. What was this guy? This guy is my carpenter. So it would be nice to be able to turn him back into my carpenter and then use uh, use the other guy as a builder. And hopefully we'll get some more people. Because that's awesome. I mean, we've got plenty of food. 200 food? Or I'm assuming that that's plenty of food. I don't know. I mean, hopefully we can get some of this stuff mined out. Now, they apparently can't mine this stuff yet. Yeah, iron ore is beyond his ability right now. I don't know what level it requires. Now, it's been brought to my attention, at least on the forums, as I had read prior to this update actually releasing, or right after it might have been, I'm not certain, that ore is now 
a level dependent thing. I don't know if it still, you know, requires a certain style of pickaxe. I don't know if that pickaxe just works faster. Yeah, and they're even saying this ore is beyond my skill to mine. So we've got two miners, and why are they both over there? Do we not have any more? Let me go to design. Oh no, we've still got some stuff over here yonder. Yo, come come back this way here, Junior. Come on, Junior. Oh, Oster said, well, I want to go hang out with my big brother. He's over here. Get back over here and mine the dirt. Get over here and mine the damn dirt. Go empty. I don't care if you want to go empty, go empty. Ah, that's what he was doing. See, I was grabbing him, pulling him back. He was going to empty. <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'll eventually learn to believe everybody and just leave them the heck alone. Let's turn this back. Well, no, I kind of need that on. I wish you could make this display stay up without having to have that up. You know, just like you could click it or hover it or something and the display would appear, you know, appear for you. Devs, you know, may, may consider that maybe. But, uh, you know, even or, either or, it's not that, you know, it's not so bad to, to have to have that popped out unless you happen to have a window up right there because you want your fans to see this, uh, to see more. This old boy is getting busy on the building right there. I mean, he's getting it going. How much, uh, oh, that's what the problem is. Our mason is, whoa, wait, why, why is our stone mason chilling? We need bricks. Did I, did I not set it up to keep so many? So it's going to be processed material. Oh, I bet I didn't. No, I did. Maintain and storage, 50. So what don't we have? Um, we need to go to raw materials and probably, no, we got plenty of dirt. We got plenty of stone. Well, there's my, there's my stone mason. I'm just, yeah, he's making bricks now. I'm just being retarded. My bad. It happens. So what is this guy? Selfina. I will eventually, guys, I will eventually learn. I'm going to pull this down, then it won't be up there in the way. I will, uh, my carpenter. So if she's my carpenter. And this guy's my builder. He doesn't have any bricks to build with, and she's not doing anything. Then why was I... What was my builder originally? Let's go in and look. I thought this was my carpenter. Carpentry 3. Um, No, wait. This was my fighter. Wasn't it? Yeah, my infantry guy. He was only two. No, that's my... I've got him out. See, this is why, this is why you want one person for each job. You just assign a person a job and try and keep them there. Uh, what was this guy? I don't know. Don't matter. He can do many things. He might have been foraging for a while. Farmer. Carpenter. Huh. I don't know. I can make him do anything, though, so it don't matter. Hmm. Yeah, I really don't know. Anyway, we're good. I mean, I can set these guys to doing stuff, too. And just to help out, but, you know, we still got to wait on this guy to make bricks. You could always, I could always build another workbench and forge and then set this guy to stone mason. I'd be popping bricks out twice as fast. But, again, as I told you in the first episode, I'm not a big fan of that whole swapping around because the same crap that happens is what just happened to me. I, I, my memory goes back, oh, well, all about 10 minutes. So what I did 20 minutes ago, I, uh... I can't fix. There, there was a bush. In the, it was right there. There was a couple bushes that I noticed when I was going back and compiling the videos. Or, well, it's not really called compiling the videos. When I was rendering the videos. That I noticed was wrong. Something, you know, in, with the road. That's one. There was a bush right there that's not there anymore. And the other was... It ran past a bush up here somewhere and right there and I wasn't sure there now it's at least two the whole way so I didn't know if your roads have to be two or if they can only be one or what but now it's fixed so let's cancel the design and let them keep going well they already were going good deal so you know, as you can tell, I'm not like an expert at this game. I'm really not, unfortunately. But I do know enough about it to be dangerous, so that's something. 
Now, I did play it back in the day when I first bought it. And I actually built up a pretty decent sized town. And once we get these walls up and get these bricks going and all this other good stuff, and my miners are still back over there instead of mining this dadgum dirt where we need. Because I want to go ahead and design the wall. There you go. Mine right there. We need to give these guys names, too. So if you're watching and you want, uh, if we can, let me check and see if we can. Can you rename the settlers? Oh, yeah, you can. So if you guys want your name in my game, because I'm telling you now, I'm going to do a full playthrough whether people watch it or not. Um, I will do this regardless. So if you want your name in the game, leave a comment. Let me know that you want your name in the game. If nobody cares, nobody does, then I'll just start eventually, you know, after a few more episodes, I'll start naming them whatever I feel like naming them. Don't matter to me either way. Oops. Went a little bit too far forward. But there you go. Get that stuff mined up, buddy. And I got something right there. That's a bush. We'll have to cut that down. Hopefully they can from one level, or one sea level, you know, under it. Or, well, no, that's the same thing. Well, yeah, no, it's one sea level below it. Oh, I'd like to get a knife built so that we can start, you know, gathering up some of these chickens. I'd like to kill a few so that I've got some feathers. I think it's a, uh, it's a uh, woodcutter's job to cut trees, them bushes and stuff. So we need one of our woodcutters, which they're way out here. Look at all this deforestation that they've done. These guys are just maniacal, Paul Bunyan style. I mean, these fellas are just taking them out tree after tree. Yeah. They are doing some work. So, what are we doing? One does not simply farm without a hoe. Why don't you have a hoe? Let's see. How many hoes do we have? We don't have any hoes. Alright, guy. I want you to make bricks. I really do. But I want you to make the other stuff that needs to be made also. Alright, so let's see. Because it's not in the queue. That's one thing I've noticed about this is that when you set them up to be done, like here at Hand Tools, they don't list in the queue. So where's the hose? <laughs> don't say it. The club. Stone hose, zero. Maintain and storage, three. It's one raw wood, which we've got 250 of, and it's two raw stone. So let's just take this feller right here. Uh, who is my carpenter, and will temporarily turn them into a, <coughs> excuse me, into a stone mason so that they can just make some tools. All right, make some tools. There you go. He's making a hoe. This guy's so busy with these bricks, man. He's just, he's like, I ain't got time to make you a damn hoe. Use your fingers. I'm making walls here. The goblins will be here soon. Stop breaking your tools, dummy. Alright, he's making tools. Oh, he must be he's making pickaxes. Alright, make some hoes. There we go. That's a hoe. That's a hoe. $25 hoe. Alright. Did he get his hoe and go back to Yeah, there you go. Get out there and farm, boy. Yeah, that's not too good. That that hole. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I mean, maybe there's a way. Maybe I just don't know how. But if you look in the queue, it shows four twine. And if you look down here, let's see, stone hole. Is there a way to prioritize from this? And I don't think that there is. I think it's you're just basically going to have to continue doing like you used to do. Watch them and make some more if you start to get low. Because when you put it in here, it, it goes into the queue. You know, in the top, currently in queue. None. Uh, maintaining storage is one of them deals that it kind of probably goes down the list and because the stone bricks are higher than the stone hose he's gonna make bricks until you know he's done with it so you gotta be paying a little bit of attention to it apparently and yeah we've got a little bit of an amb this ambient occlusion glitch on some of these stone piles and some of these other things but it's not you know here I'll just turn it off for a little while I'm sure that somebody, somebody's going to have an issue with it and art, you know, complain or something. So it's not, it doesn't, 
it doesn't deter from the graphics whatsoever. I mean, it just takes the shadows and drops the shadows out, or not even all of them, but just the, you know, that, you know, the ambient occlusion, that darkness that that's added to everything to represent shadow and surface texture, or whatever it does. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure. You're all sitting there saying, "Sure, saying, saying, just play the game, shut the hell up." And that's what I'll. Well, don't you don't want me to shut up? Because then it'd be quite boring to watch. Oh, so today is Saturday, man. I spent all day today compiling videos. I did eight videos of RimWorld. I finished out the Escapist. You will get a video of that every other day or so. I did three videos of this already today. That I or well, I, you know, I made them ready for YouTube. Better is a better way to put it. Um, I compiled. There we go. And, and or what, whatever it's called. You know, come on. I'm an old redneck. I don't know. Um, I did several Prison Architect. I think five or four episodes of Prison Architect today. Uh, these are, these are because I play all week and then I compile all my videos on the week, on the weekend, and then put them out. You know, if it's a new game like this was, I did this last night. You know, or the other two episodes that you guys have watched. I did last night, or the other three episodes by now, actually. Um, so, I did this right after release. Man, I couldn't wait to play this game. I still can't. I mean, I just, and you you want to hear about suffering. You want to hear about pain. I sat around all day today, because, you know, doing these videos and stuff, a lot of people really don't understand the work that we put into these videos. I mean, go back and look at one of my original videos and then look at the stuff that I do today and you'll notice that there's a huge difference in, in between the, you know, between the two. Um, most of it is, you know, feedback from a lot of you guys that have said, hey, this, that, and the other. And like now I just found out that the uh, first and second episode of this and some of my other videos, the volume levels have been quite low. Well, that's because I've got a Blue Yeti microphone that I like to use. But unfortunately, as you've heard in a few of my videos, not very many because I edit a lot of it out, but I have a family around here and my daughter likes to come in and, and jibber jabber and run her mouth. You know, any of my Factorio fans that are that are watching these shows know exactly who I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> and she likes to come in and make noise and you know the other family members when they're here or something they'll beat on the door and come in and talking and, and I've told them all you know look if I'm wearing my headset because I've got a uh, a Razer Tiamat headset uh, if I'm wearing my headset that means that I'm recording that's just my little signal if you walk in my room and I've got a headset on I'm recording you know a let's play and the reason that I can talk right now, guys, and not really need to talk about the games because I'm still waiting on them to get this stuff done. But, uh, you know, that's my little signal to them is that if I've got my headset on, you know, you come in my room, shut the hell up. Don't don't talk. Come up, tap me on the shoulder, let me know. I can then pause the game, pause the recording, and then answer your question. You can get the heck out of my room. Um, what do we got there? Nothing. All right, so we're back to building. So let's go back to construction, walls. And I think we did all those out of castle brick, right? Yeah, it looks right. It looks the same. Let's make sure. Because I'm making sure it was... Nah, it was castle brick. It was just regular old... Yeah, boy. So we're going to come down to... All right, we got to dig over one more, if you haven't noticed. Because I don't like this being level. Well, I guess it don't matter, because we're going to come up. But I can dig that out which we're going to do. We are going to do it. Dig mine. And we're going to dig out, you know, up to about, I don't know, about there to be fine. Because I don't want anything, I don't want to, I don't want to have to have it an additional level high. You, you'll see what I'm talking about when we get to it. Um, but, you know, that's my signal, is that if I'm wearing the headset, you know, when you come into my room, kind of be quiet, tap me on the shoulder, get my attention, and then I can pause it, deal with you, and you can go on about your business. But, uh, you know, I, so I, 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 I don't use the Yeti because of that situation. I'm getting ready to move in a couple months. My lease will be up here, and I don't plan to extend my lease in this townhouse. And when I do move, I'm going to move, you know, somewhere where I'll have an office. I'm going to get something big enough to where I'll have an office. I can close the door, put a little sign on the door that says I'm recording, shut the beep up, and uh, 
you know, whatnot. But for right now, I can't really use that Blue Yeti. So I'm having to use this Tiamat microphone on this headset. And that's why it's got not really a hollow sound to it, but it's not as clear as the Blue, Le Blue Yeti. It, it doesn't sound as professional. But uh, also, I didn't realize it because I play on, fl on flat panel mon or TVs. I don't play on monitors anymore. And my audio I have coming out, I listen to it through the TV. And the TV's amped up pretty high so that I can hear it, you know, decent. And uh, I never realized, make a long story short, that my volume was low because it plays so loud on my system. But I, tonight had one of the devs come into my into my YouTube channel and post a comment and mentioned that, you know, you know, talked about some stuff and, and mentioned, oh, you. Oh, my gosh. You guys know what this is, right? That's a full unit list, all of their jobs, what their skill levels are in their jobs, and then the jobs that they're currently using. That is, that is brilliant. He did this in one day, he said. He typed in my channel and said it took him one day to do this. That is freaking brilliant. Now, I wonder if you can change their... Oh, my God, you can. That is freaking amazing. <laughs> That is just fantastic. So you hit you to bring that up. And you can just look at their jobs, look at the, you know, see what levels they are at a certain jobs, flip flop them. You don't have to go back to each individual. Oh, that is just fantastic. Fan, thank you very much for coming on my uh, coming on my YouTube and, and telling me that, Ethereal. I really appreciate that. That's amazing. That's just that's that is, that's brilliant. All right, but uh, we got a little bit of our wall done, and this all done, and that all done. But back to the story, since we're, they're about to be sleeping, and I'm about to pause the recording. They, uh, the, 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 the microphone changed. I didn't realize that I was so low. And then because he came onto my, my channel and mentioned the volume level was low to him, that he, it wasn't bad, but he had to turn his up a little bit. I then put my headset on and listened to it through my headset. Normally, when I do my video editing, I'm listening to the volume through the flat panel, and the flat panel's turned up to about 70, so it's pretty loud. I didn't realize that at a nominal level of about 40, maybe 50, that I'm actually, but my volume has actually been kind of low. So I apologize to all my listeners and, and watchers and viewers and whatnot that, uh, you know, I didn't know. I didn't know. And uh, one of you actually gave me a, a down vote on a video and mentioned it and I was like man that guy's just got to be flipping whack he's got there's got to be something wrong with him because I listen I watch all my videos before I put them on YouTube and they're all loud and pretty and sound great to me almost too loud and now I realize why because I had my my freaking video on my TV my audio on my TV up to like 70 or 80 and of course it's loud I mean good golly you can hear a gnat fart coming from that loud but when I put the headset on, I realized, well, you know, mm -hmm. it actually is kind of, it's not silent, but it's a little on the low side. So this video, you should automatically already notice that this video, the volume has been amped up a good bit. I've almost doubled the volume. Um, I hope that it's not too loud. So this is your chance to let me know. If the volume is too loud, I can turn it down just a little bit. I've got the ability, you know, with this Naga, or I mean with this Tiamat. If it's not loud enough still, let me know, and I can try and turn the, uh, the uh, whatchamacallit, up, the gain, the gain up some. But uh, I'm hoping that this is a good median, that this is just, you know, all around this episode, that the volume is just pretty good. All right, enough about the home stories. We've got about six minutes left in the video, and everybody, oh, they're all back to work. They didn't sleep that long. Hmm. That or I just got, you know, I got so long-winded talking to you guys that I, I didn't really pay too much attention to it. And that's probably the latter is probably what happened. But man, this map, I, that's one thing that I haven't done. I haven't really shown you guys this map. We've got this lake that comes in, and I really, I really can't wait to get creative with that. And then on the other side, we've got this river that goes all the way up and down. So we're going to get to build a bridge. 
and then we'll probably build another little outlook station or outpost type station over here with a nice bridge that comes across it. And of course, we'll bring the bridge across here at the narrow point. And uh, yeah, I mean, we're going to get really cool with this or try to, you know, I'm, I'm going to. Hopefully it'll, uh, my creativity skills aren't lacking so much that, uh, you know, it's like, man, that guy just ain't no good because they've added in so many building building things I mean literally you can go into construction you can go into walls and then you've got all of these different like with the castle brick you got all these different angles that you can use now I don't know how <coughs> excuse me but they're there and I don't know what some of these are and I don't know how to use them <laughs> but we're gonna figure it out so let's see uh, 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 no, 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 no. no, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you can't make these angles out of castle brick. Maybe that's what it is. Let's go to timbered plaster. Well, no, it's not letting me do them in there either. Huh. Maybe right click. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know how to do use this this tool. I will, oh wait, we got storage issues. I will figure it out, more wood. So we need, need. ooh, we've got, we got plenty of wood. I'm just going to leave it like it is for right now. Um, ooh, it rotates with you. That's, you can rotate it with the mouse. Um, I don't, I don't know what these mean. A tool tip would be nice, devs. I mean, just a, you know, a tool tip, like when you hover it, have it pop up and say, you know, whatever you got to do to place that slanting, that slant. Let me see. We only got a few minutes, so this is what we'll do. We'll tinker. And we'll, we'll leave it paused. We'll build that. Can you click it after you place it, maybe? No? All right, what is this? What is that? What is that? Now what? Maybe you right click it, middle click it. Middle click seems to center your mouse. That's kind of cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know how to build angles. Maybe it's not actually in the game yet. I don't know. I'll check out the wiki though, and I will know for the next episode, and I will let you guys know, and then we'll start out the next episode, and if it's possible to do, I'll know how to do it, because that's kind of a, let's go back to this. We'll go like that and shift alt and get rid of that one. Everything else we want built. But I'll figure out how to do it, how it works in the wiki or on the website or ask a question or whatnot. And I'll know for the next uh, for the next episode. Yeah, because they're all grayed out. Maybe your builder has to be a certain level. I mean, who knows? It could be anything. Yeah, I don't know. All right, I'll figure it out, though, and let you guys know in the next episode. So, hope you're enjoying this. I hope the volume's better. And uh, if you like it, please like, comment, or subscribe, or do all three if you feel, you know, all kind of giddy about this, uh, like I am. And I will see you guys in the next episode. All right, have a great day.